Check this out. Uh, my buddy partner, uh, wait, wait, don't go yet. Uh, William, owner of Young Master Street Service, taught me this for years landscaping when we go to the dump. We don't have hydraulic dump trucks yet. But we would uh, put all the debris in the truck and bust our asses just pulling it all out by hand and raking it and shoveling it. And just like, it would take 40 minutes just to empty a load. So <laughs> what he showed me is. So we're talking. All right, let me show you the ultimate way to, you know, if you don't have a hydraulic dump truck, obviously, to dump an, ent <laughs> to dump an entire load of brush without plucking your ass and pulling it out by hand. Take a rope for, you know, tree climbing, a tow rope, whatever. You run it all the way through down the bottom of the bed with an extra good 15 feet. The bottom of the bed, I know you can't see, but then over the top and let it go over the roof. So you got rope down hanging from the bed and then over the roof, put all your brush on top of it and then you wrap the rope around the entire Go! Go! Look at that, look at that. 40 minutes of work saved. Goddamn bro! <laughs> damn bro, but I never mind the damn rope! Goddamn rope! <laughs> 40 minutes of work saved, wrap hey, up your rope. Show the log. Yeah, I did show him the log. <laughs> Alright then, uh, that's your uh, tip of the day. Okay. This is what happens when you put a yard of peat moss in the blue goose. dreaming of the past or future. It's completely in the present moment. This is the now. Rochester. We've got 
got a cracked windshield. We're waiting. But we're looking. Are you happy? I'm fucking jumping with joy. We're in Kroger's right now. We're grocery shopping. I know. We gotta show the cameraman. Sexy woman. Bench here. It's Sunday, September 11th. Today is very peaceful because it's a memorial of 9/11, and it's a beautiful day. This is probably the second or third time we've gone to the park this summer. We're so busy. Today is like the perfect day. <laughs> He's a good boy. Yes, he is a good boy. You having fun, Miko? <laughs> <laughs> 